Imagine a film so terrifying, even the director himself is haunted by its potential. That's right, Mike Flanagan, the mastermind of modern horror, is about to give us what he promises to be the scariest movie he's ever made. Are you ready to dive into the twisted rebirth of The Exorcist? After The Exorcist, Believer left fans disillusioned, Blumhouse is taking a bold step with a brand new installment led by the horror genius himself, Mike Flanagan. With a vision to bring something truly new to the iconic horror franchise, Flanagan is determined to leave audiences shaken to their core. But what exactly does he have in store? Yes, you heard that right. Flanagan's vision for The Exorcist is set to premiere on the ultimate day of horror, Friday the 13th. It's a risky move, but isn't that what we all want? A horror experience that tempts fate itself. Blumhouse is betting big on this day of bad luck, hoping to breathe new life into a franchise that has struggled to reclaim the terror of the 1973 classic. What's different about this take, you ask? Flanagan's not just recycling old scares, he's promised to make this the most terrifying experience yet. We aren't making this easy on ourselves, he admits, fully aware of the high expectations surrounding his approach. And in true Flanagan style, he's looking to go deeper than just jump scares. He's crafting a horror story that lingers with you, crawls under your skin, and refuses to let go. Flanagan isn't interested in simple nostalgia or safe storytelling. He's chasing the scariest vision he's ever pursued. Known for his hauntingly intimate characters and stories that feel uncomfortably close to home, this film promises to connect us to its characters in a way that's both deeply human and utterly horrifying. Think of the dread in The Haunting of Hill House or Doctor Sleep. Now imagine that amplified within the world of The Exorcist. So what can we expect from the story itself? Here's what we know so far. This isn't a sequel to Believer. In fact, Flanagan's vision seems to completely reset the franchise. With talk of an all-new demonic presence and a radical new approach, it's clear he's digging deep to create a horror tale that honors the original's impact but isn't held back by its past. Could this be the movie that finally surpasses the 1973 original? Flanagan himself has acknowledged the immense pressure surrounding this project. He admits, no one's more intimidated than I am. But that's exactly why he fought for it. This is his chance to redefine horror, to create something that speaks to a new generation while respecting the fear the original embedded in our minds. March 13th, 2026. Will you be brave enough to witness Flanagan's vision of horror come to life? A story that doesn't just aim to scare, but to haunt. Prepare yourself, because The Exorcist is coming back, and this time it might just be unforgettable.